Yo, yo, giddy, yo, YouTube. Greetings and salutations. It is your boy, Uncle Jidge, coming at you again from the booth with another fire reaction. And I'm excited to continue my journey with a brand new group that we have been rocking with here on the channel for the last week or so, and that is the Night Wish Army. Super excited, because as you know, and I've mentioned in the past, I'm a bit of a metalhead myself, been into that genre and scene for a number of years, mostly on the American side, but have recently been introduced to some of the more epic European bands, and I'm excited to continue to explore more and more. And those of you who came at... Uh, me in the comments with other uh, band suggestions. I am mulling them over and trying to figure out the best opportunity to drop a reaction for those as well. So stay tuned to the channel. And if it's your first time, make sure you hit that subscription button. Make sure you give us a thumbs up. Get at us in the comments. Let us know how you feel about what's going down on the channel. And uh, observations, maybe some things you'd like to see us react to inside of the music world, the metal world, the symphonic metal world, or maybe outside, who knows. But without any further ado, I'm getting into another piece from the, the Wacken or the Wacken uh, Music Festival 2013, which is where I started my Nightwish journey and I'm going to continue. And this is of the live performance of Romanticide. Uh, and this was in the comments from multiple people, so I'm super excited to be able to bring that reaction to you. So let's get into it. Here we go. Three, two, one. Boom. <laughs>
listen, 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 listen. So up until this point, I have obviously been super impressed. Um, you know, just like floored, no pun intended, I say it all the time, by how amazing this band is, the culmination of the music, the melodic styling, that symphonic style, um, you know, Floor's angelic vocals, her range is insane, and just everything that they do has this really, like, you know, amazing, you know, synergy to it. But this, yo, this is what I'm all about. I'm a metalhead from back in the day, and my favorite concerts of all time, Kill Switch Engage. I don't know if you guys are familiar with Kill Switch. They're a band, a hardcore band out of Massachusetts, and they are absolutely my favorite. And I was big for about 10 years into the hardcore scene uh, in North Carolina. That's where I was living at the time. And when I first got into the heavier, heavier side of music, always, always a fan of the the hair bands of the '80s, and you know, into the into you know the Van Halens and the and the um, you know Motley Crues and things like that. But man, oh man, when I really got introduced to the heaviest, heaviest uh, hardcore and speed metal and thrash metal styles, obviously Metallica, and you know, you have to give props to Iron Maiden and you know all the uh you know the godfathers the ones that would be on the the um Mount Rushmore if you will of the greatest rock bands of all time but man I really got into the metal because there was something so pounding so dri- so driven energetic the first time I ever heard Rose of Sharon by uh Kill Switch Engage I uh, my mind was blown and I am feeling that right now with Romanticize oh my goodness you guys unbelievable the triples the doubles that energy that driving beat the double kick was just fire unbelievable and then floor was killing it right she had this amazing vocal styling that ran from the guttural to that you know the scream style to that angelic vocals and then uh my man who i will not pronounce his name the right way the bassist who came in with kind of that funk almost limp biscuity kind of hip hoppy rap style vocal kind of chanting but then singing and then they did those amazing harmonies oh my goodness guys i'm i'm floored i'm i'm sorry i keep using that term i'm blown away you know my mind you know it was absolutely on point just everything musically what I, it was what i'm looking for when i go to a concert i want high energy from the jump i want it to be uh driven and moving and pulsing and you know almost you know um trance like because you're just getting into the vibe and then such you know like such ethereal lyrical content once again very poetic very much about the the essence of existence and and you know that sort of mystical kind of um, you know, fantasy style, which is really uh, something I dig because I think it's kind of a cool vibe. Again, you know, when you cut your teeth on bands like, uh, you know, Led Zeppelin and and you hear uh, the Immigrant Song and you just, it, you know, drudges up the ideal, you know, the, the imagery of, um, of the Norse mythology and the gods and thunder and lightning and, you know, the, you know, the realm eternal and things like that. I mean, that's what this this song had that vibe and that feel, but even more, I mean, some of their other stuff was more, um, you know, I said about their last tune that I did a reaction to the name is escaping me, um, where it felt a lot like a, uh, a, a soundtrack to some of the more, uh, a mystical um, and and a magical realm style films of the 80s. But this, this was just pure get after it metal and I am here for it. It was fantastic. Thank you guys so much who came in the comments and said this is one to, to rock out to. And this is my vibe. Listen, I'm, I'm loving everything about this journey because they are not a one trick pony. They don't just give you one style. They don't just give you one tempo. They don't give you just one... Uh, you know, beats per minute type of uh, a type of music, which, you know, is can oftentimes be a problem for a lot of bands. You know, you hear one song, you've heard all the songs and you've heard an entire album and maybe even their whole catalog. Now, if you like that, that's great. But if you don't, you want some variety. And these guys are bringing the variety, which is fantastic. So kudos, hats off. If it's your first time to the channel, thank you for stopping by. Uh, hope you're going to be rocking with us moving forward. Thanks for, um, you know, checking us out. If you're so inclined, hit the subscription button. Make sure you hit the thumbs up. Get at us in the comments. We're super excited to be 
you know, checking this out. I say we, uh, my partner Curtis Magic and I normally do this together. We haven't been able to do it together for a while. He's got a lot of things going on um, uh, personally and work-wise and whatnot, but hopefully we'll be able to get in. I want to introduce him to Nightwish because I think he would absolutely be, be blown away by them. Um, but once again, appreciate you guys. I know if you watched this video, I know if you were at that concert, you even now think of it, it brings a smile to your face, it brings joy, it brings energy, it brings heat. It's amazing. So I just want to leave you a little bit of peace. Yo, you know I'ma run this kid Shouts out to Curtis Magic and Uncle Jish yeah. When I do my lyrics, dog, I'm rapping for the faction Hit them up online for the fly-ass reactions Yeah, out to him, I be giving mad love Yo, shout to Uncle Jish, I'ma give you the plug